there was a line in that old uh, 80s movie Flashdance if you remember it uh, uh, seeing it uh, the movie it was really big uh, in the I believe it was in the mid or to late 80s there was a line where uh, she asks uh, this uh, successful uh, youngish guy you know how did you do it how did you make it all uh, you know how did you succeed in life in business he says I just closed my eyes and took a deep breath. And you know what that means, ladies and gentlemen? That means I just took a chance, I took a risk. And uh, the biggest, I'm sure this is also may sound like a uh, cliche, but the biggest regret you'll have in life when, you're, when it's all said and done, you're sitting on that rocking chair, is not having taken the chances not starting that business that you wanted to start not going on that trip that you wanted to go not asking that uh, woman that you really were curious whether or not she'll go out with you or you'll have a chance with her not doing it at all because the pain of not knowing what would have happened had you done had you made the move is unbearable is unbearable it's a life of regret. It's a life uh, you feel that was wasted because you didn't do what you really wanted to do. So if you ask anyone how they succeeded, it's no secret. People dropped out of uh, college to start a business and they succeeded. And some of them don't succeed. Majority don't succeed. Although if they're really believe in themselves if they're really go-getters if they're really the ones who don't want to live an ordinary life and would rather have nothing or everything they would keep trying but one thing that is very uh, universally common among those who succeed they are willing to take a chance and they are not willing to live an ordinary life this is what most uh, people media whatever doesn't tell you they are unwilling to live an ordinary life. No disrespect to the ones who choose to work in a cubicle and uh, punch someone else's punch card, uh, work for someone else. But if you really wanna make it big in this world, you have to do it your way. Actually, it is more pleasurable to have your own business, punch your own time clock and make less money than work for someone else and make more money because you have to abide by someone else's rule. It's like living in someone else's house where they say, oh, don't do this, don't put that there, don't put this here, take your shoes off, do this, do that, do this, you know. You, you, you'd you rather live in your car than live in someone else, under someone else's, uh, you know, roof and, and under someone else's rules. It's the same in the world of business as it is in the world of uh, romance, as it is in any uh, venture, that requires success that 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 ends in success is re it requires risk taking and it requires you not being uh not being um accepting uh of uh or or tolerating a regular normal ordinary life you feel deep inside that you deserve more now whatever that more is to you some people are satisfied with uh $15,000 a month. Some people are satisfied with nothing less than $500,000 a month. Doesn't matter. But you know what? Don't ever compare yourself to someone else and don't ever try to be like someone else. What makes you happy is different than what makes someone else happy. Don't try to say, oh, well, my yacht has to be bigger than his yacht. No, look at Elon Musk, the richest man in the world. He says he sleeps on factory floor and you know, uh, there are enough sources to verify that he's telling the truth. He could buy anything he wants in his life and he doesn't because that doesn't make him uh, happy. What makes him happy is, is being known as someone who does revolutionary things and does it better than everyone else. So if you want to know the rules for success, the first rule is you must be willing, you must have the stones as they say, to take a risk and be able to pay the price. Many people say, I wanna be rich, I wanna be successful, but they are not willing to pay the price. You must be willing to pay the price. You must be willing to face failures. Every failure is one step closer to success. 
and you must not be accepting or tolerating uh, being uh, uh, not not willing to tolerate an ordinary life not willing to tolerate driving a little beat up Toyota Corolla no you want your Aston Martin whatever that's just an example but that's what is needed you gotta have guts you gotta have guts some of us are born with guts it could be a little guy that is not afraid to fight a football player and some of us are not born with that much guts but believe me the good news is we can acquire some courage we can acquire some courage you know and how is it acquired when you take when you begin to push yourself initially to take some risks then the next risk becomes easier the next chance becomes easier like learning a language when you learn one language the second one becomes infinitely easier when you're willing to take a risk the second and third and fourth risk becomes much easier we'll continue uh, in this vein uh, in the future but i think for now that's enough